Dave Barry here alongside National Recruiting Director Rob Cassidy. Rob, some breaking news. Five-star small forward Asa Newell, he has committed to Georgia. Tell me about that and how that went down. It's been mighty interesting with him. You know, I've talked about this a lot. Like, I feel like, you know, people and mostly jilted schools want to be like, oh, Georgia's got an NLI or got a name, image, and likeness bag, whatever. But, you know, that's not really the case here. Maybe they do have some extra money nobody really knows. But this is the product of like four years of hard work by Georgia assistant coach Eric Pastrana. I mean, it's really crazy. He offered at Asa when Asa was playing at a small school, the Panhandle, and Eric was at Oklahoma State. Uh, then he moves to Florida and continues to recruit him there, offers him there. And then Asa kind of blows up, but they've already got a year and a half head start. So they end up in Florida. That staff obviously ends up in Florida. And finally, they win this battle. And I feel like it's pretty dismissive to just be like, well, you know, it's a name image likeness thing because it really isn't if you paid attention to it. I think it's a great get for Georgia and it could be the start of something there. You know, they kind of exceeded expectations last year a little bit on the court. Uh, now they've got a class coming in that could potentially include him. Uh, it could potentially include Darion Reed who commits this weekend. Uh, we don't really know where he's going to end up. He could end up in Alabama. He could end up in Georgia. But either way you slice it, uh, UJ is looking, you know, like a, a transformed program in, in year two under Mike White. Yeah, yeah, big win for the Bulldogs. All right, let's remind everybody they can follow you, Rob, on social media. Follow us on at, at Rivals.com for all the information. Rob, thank you. Dave, thank you.